Hi guys, Todd from Indio Bushcraft here. Today I want to go over my PSK. The personal survival kit, PSK, is exactly that. It's very personal. I see a lot of videos on YouTube, people showing theirs, and no two are really the same. And that's the way it should be. I mean, your kit should be what you're comfortable with. But one thing you'll see in just about all of them is a running theme for making fire, shelter, and water. And, and mine's going to follow along the same lines. Alright. So I carry my kit in this utility pouch. It's a Molly compatible, simple utility pouch I got for about 12 bucks. Um, I keep it on my belt a lot of times when I'm out or if I have a pack with me. I might attach it to the pack. Inside, it's got two compartments, one with the flap cover and one that zips. I carry an emergency poncho, it's a simple plastic poncho. survival blanket, one of those mylar blankets, a large folded piece of tin foil. Um, this has multiple uses. If I had to, I could try to shape it into a bowl to hold water, or I could use it to help start a fire if the ground's wet or there's snow out. Simple little first aid kit. There's really not much in this. It's, um, Got several band-aids, some cotton ball, and the Vaseline stuffed in straws, some Imodium, a lighter, small mirror for signaling, a butterfly bandage, some Benadryl. and some insect repellent. Cup of soup. In the front pocket, I have about 20 feet of paracord. A bottle of um, Purification tablets. These are the Coglin purification tablets. And it's wrapped in, I don't know, about 8 to 10 feet of electric tape. And pull up that electric tape if I need to use it for something. The zipper has a small zipper compass attached to it. GI sharpening stone. Small flashlight, I don't know if you can tell in the sun, um, it's actually attached to the pack, so don't lose it. Fire kit and an Altoids tin, if I have this attached to my pack, I actually take this out and keep it in my pocket. It has a um, ferro rod a tin knife that I made myself from a file and a knife will actually strike the rod a lighter with some jute a couple of fire straws and more tin foil inside to help start a fire if I needed to flick the heat back And the knife that I keep in my PSK is a Becker Remora. It's a good little knife. And I keep it on a lanyard and wear it on my neck if I need it. I also have this extra little, um, kind of like a 
SAK Classic, but it's made by Zippo. It's a blade, a file, and a little pair of scissors. In the front pocket, I carry a small little fishing kit. It's about, I don't know, about 20 feet of line maybe rolled up, some slip shot, and some hooks. And that's pretty much it. I mean, I guess if, I, if something did happen, and you know, on my belt, I typically keep when I'm out a fixed blade knife, a leather case with a zippo, and this if, if I don't have my pack on. So if something happened and I lost my knife and my zippo got ruined and this is all I had, I feel with these items in here I could definitely get by for a couple of days. Um, unless it was really, really severe weather I might, might have a problem but even then the survival blanket poncho I, I could try to make a shelter and I definitely have enough in here to start a fire between four or five fire straws and a ferro rod and a lighter so that's my PSK thanks